क्लास टेंथ डी सो ऑल द पॉइंट ऑलमोस्ट वी हैव रिटर्न चैप्टर इज अबाउट टू बी कंप्लीटेड दिस रिविजन फाइन हाफ ऑफ द चैप्टर वॉज डन यस्टरडे ओनली Lenko's eagerness on receiving a reply. So we have revised it till the point when Lenko, uh, you know, again put the for for the first time he wrote a letter to God about what happened in his life and he was expecting and seeking help from God and he stamped on the letter put in the mailbox. Postmaster had a hearty laugh, but then he realized that what a conviction this man has, what a unquestionable faith he has in God. he wished he could have such faith so he decided to help him in any way so he collected uh, pesos from all the employees of uh, post office but he could collect 70 pesos but farmer lenko had asked for 100 pesos so he put that money into the envelope and again a uh, post man himself handed him over to lenko eagerness was visible because lenko reached in the po at the post office well in time or in advance we can say because he was eagerly waiting chahat skip the desk and sit the la last second one please so he was quite eager on receiving a reply from god fine but when he opened the letter he reads and he just counts the money and he became disheartened he was disheartened or dejected or sad or and angry mainly he started showing his anger he was disheartened and angry why he was angry but you were talking you can sit here on the second desk in this row so he was disheartened and angry he was angry with god he was angry with god because you know before uh, after this lecture now i will just see a few of you very casual attitude you have without the permission of teachers you people are allowing to enter and go and sit and stand shift there in that row and sit over there all alone last bench so he was this heartened and angry why he was angry yes navya yes he received 70 pesos in the letter fine then lenko wrote another letter to god write down next point next point is he wrote another letter to god in that letter what was the content of the second letter he actually he was so sure that god is going to send him money that shows his faith in almighty but he called post office employees yes bunch of crooks a bunch of crooks it means cheaters last point write down he doubted the integrity of post office employees he doubted last point write down he doubted the integrity and honesty both the words you need to write he doubted the honesty and integrity of post office employees clear but uh, when uh, he thought that it is a joint decision everybody here is dishonest in a grouping way you know fine all together so he is not naming one person he is calling all together that all are bunch of crooks here they might have divided my money or they might have taken my money so in that way so he doubted the honesty or integrity and integrity of post office employee so chapter ends here so what we have learned out of this chapter that one 
the person who is having unquestionable faith having faith in god is something else fine but being stupid and foolish enough that you are not able to see the people who are actually helping you you are calling them bunch of crooks that is also not acceptable so one should have unshaken faith in god supreme power almighty but at the same time the person should be smart enough to perceive that who is helping him and who is you know in the favor of the person and who is not so he was foolish enough he was having blind faith i must say so that blindness should not be there you should have faith you should have confidence that yes god is there to help you but how god will help you he himself will not come he is having his messengers in the form of other human beings who will be helping you finally and that is the help of god only you know when you are in trouble and you just pray to god and you know some solution comes out and then you say thank god aapne meri help kar di but you are smart enough to perceive this fine but lenko was foolish that he was not able to find out who was actually helping him so this chapter is clear now i would be uh, you know asking you the questions i'll be sharing screen with you all yes children sitting at home and there you can see mcqs of this chapter fine only questions not answers so my first question is what did lenko hope for let me give the options a good share of rain and crop option b a new motorcycle option c a tractor option d none of the above yes option a lenko hoped for a good shower of rain and crop this is very easy one so this i am just with this introducing the mcqs i am also telling you what will happen in the exams you people are thinking doing mcqs is very easy for me you are going to appear in offline exams that is clear to you fine you will be getting omr sheet or how you will be performing or writing that will tell you later on but let me tell you the complexity of questions is not going to be that easy for you to attempt there will be mixed questions there will be some questions straight away that like this you are able to find the answer even without even i just spoke the options also there will be questions in which you will be having doubt in two options and there will be the toughest one when there four options there seem to be an answer fine so be prepare accordingly this is the side i'll shade where easy questions are there second question is why was lenko satisfied option a on seeing a new buffalo on seeing a new tractor in his field on seeing the field of ripe corn with flowers or on seeing rain apne bina soche hath khada kar liya are you sure about the answer now i told you that there will be two options where you can be confused yes jia dhavan rain yes who says ro yes tanya what is your answer confused between two i told you sir so here we have dakshita who is raising hand wait yes dakshita you can answer this beta ma'am on seeing rain on seeing rain is it written anywhere this is you know what happens is we just start perceiving so that's why i say you need to read the chapter he was satisfied on seeing the field of ripe corn with flowers which was visible from his own house only fine so ye kaise aap attempt karoge when you will be reading it okay so that's why this is one little complex fine why did why did lenko need money a children sitting at home beta you can see i am i am just modifying the questions 
वनीता क्वेश्चन ये वाला नहीं है पहले सुन लो यू आर रेजिंग द हैंड सिटिंग एट होम आई एम से जो क्वेश्चन स्क्रीन पे आपके आ रहे हैं आई एम गोइंग टू मॉडिफाई इट क्योंकि स्क्रीन पे जो आ रहा है वो तो बहुत ईजी है ठीक है इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी विच आई शेड बिकॉज उन्होंने बनाए ही नहीं है क्वेश्चन ईजी है आई एम मॉडिफाइंग इट सो ध्यान से सुनने जो घर पे भी बैठे हैं वो बच्चे Why did Lenko need money? Option A, to save his family from hunger. Fine. Option B, to buy new land and grow crop on it. Fine. Option C, for the reproduction of crop. Option D, both A and C. Fine. Here A and C both. is the answer you are able to perceive why because you have listened to the chapter very good fine and none of the option is written here wait wait no are you in class 6 now that i have put lines in children sitting at home also they are uh, you know yes beta yes wait next question is who read the letter to god sent by lenko who read the letter sent by lenko fine uh, option a postmaster option b postman option c the god himself and option d his wife option a postmaster now without looking here and there books band hai sabki fine close it close it This question is for offline students because children at home can see it from the books. Who is the author of the lesson a letter to God? Let me speak. G. L. Uh, Pierce, J. K. Rowling, William Shakespeare, Roald Dahl. Option. Yes. G. L. पढ़ लिया था इसने. You are not going to attain any prize or jumping like anything. ओके नाउ आई विल नेम अ चाइल्ड दैट चाइल्ड विल आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन पहले क्वेश्चन सभी सुनेंगे टर्न किसी की भी आ सकती है जिसकी आ चुकी है दोबारा भी आ सकती है सो बी रेडी व्हाट इज द आयरनी इन दिस लेसन तानिया लेट मी गिव द ऑप्शंस क्या पता आप जो बोलो वो ऑप्शन में नहीं हो व्हाट इज द आयरनी इन दिस लेसन आयरनी सबको पता क्या होती है आयरनी आयरनिकल सिचुएशन ओके Lenko was sad after the hailstorm, even though he was the one waiting for a shower. पहली ऑप्शन है, I repeat. Lenko was sad after the hailstorm, even though he was waiting for the shower of rain. Option B. Postmaster laughed at Lenko, but still helped arrange money for him. Option C. Lenko blamed the post office employees. who in fact helped him option d there is no irony in any statement soch lo pehle you have to explain me what an irony is princey c okay one is uh, princey has given uh, that option c let me uh, ask bisam yes bisam you will explain Ma'am, it's option C because in the irony, the situ uh, situation is something else than what expected. That makes it a little funny. Yes, this is what I was expecting. Fine, it's too easy, but you need to explain why it is an irony. Okay, when situation is something else, what we expected to it to it become fine. Then next is. Our uh, next question is very easy. What does Lencho uh, think of post office employees? He called them bunch of crooks. Vanita, next turn. I'm going to give you.
Shall I wait for you all? Ducks, come and stand here. One person starts and the rest of the class follows. Behave. Why was Lenko not supposed, uh, not surprised on seeing the money in the envelope? This question goes to Vanita. She has been raising hand. So, uh, beta, yes, you can give answer. You can see the question on the screen. Question for you all. He was too sad to acknowledge it. He had, you will be giving answer to it. Stand up. It's too easy for you, Vivan. Why was Lenko not surprised on seeing the money in the envelope? He had unwavering faith in God. He was an ungrateful man. He was too sad to acknowledge it. Vanita has not raised hand. I gave that question to Vanita and she's not raising hand. So this question goes to Mehek. From the option, because he had unwavering faith in God. He has unwavering faith in God. Yes, ma'am. No. Any other? What is option A here? He was too sad to acknowledge it. He had unwavering faith in God. He was an ungrateful man. Let me say, I'm just checking only. Yes, Vanita, what's your answer? Slow motion. Maybe some problem is there with the mic. So, fine. Uh, no, it's audible, but it was lingering only. So, I'm just saying, answer given by Mehek was correct. Fine. I was just checking whether you believe it or not. He has unwavering faith in God. Unwavering means which does not shake. Fine. So, that was the correct answer, Vanita. Kindly make it clear. Answer given by Mehek was correct. Next question is... Why did the postmaster decide to reply to Lenko's letter? Number one, option A, he was a generous man. Option B, he was empathetic towards Lenko. Option C, he wanted to keep Lenko's faith intact. Fourth, all of the above. Those who are saying all of the above, raise your hand. Wrong answer. So this is, here, these are the questions where your vocabulary will be checked, beta. Intact means it does not change. Yes. Yes, Dakshita, beta. Ma'am, as postmaster was friendly, so he decided to preserve Lenko's faith in God. Uh, that's why he replied to his letter. Yes, so he wanted his faith to be intact. He wanted ki such an unquestionable faith he had in God that I should remain it. I should help him in keeping this faith in God. Otherwise, he will not believe in God. Is clear. Option C. Better, it's not generous, is kind. Generous ka meaning kya hota hai? That is the part of character sketch. Aap kabhi padna chapter mein. That he wanted that his faith not to be shaken up. That's why he decided ki iska faith chala jayega agar mein help nahi karunga. It is mentioned. But the, tabhi to confuse, confusion create karni hai humne. No, they are saying question up Suna the answer value. They can be a question. Pe, let me discuss this question only. Yes, the question is why did postmaster decide to reply to Lenko's letter? This question pe sabke alag -alag answer and views hai. clear, and you will be getting these questions or just made two correct answers. I am telling you on face. 
आपके एग्जाम में ऐसे क्वेश्चन आएंगे इन विच दे विल बी टू करेक्ट आंसर लाइक दिस वन हाउ कम पोस्ट मास्टर वॉज जेनरस दिस इज नॉट रॉन्ग He was sad also. This is not wrong. Fine. Okay, I'll discuss about that also. So I'm talking about firstly this question that yes, you are right. He was a generous man. He was having the feeling of empathy for others. Fine. तभी आपने all of the above बोल दिया. But यहाँ पे आपके text में mentioned है he wanted this faith to be continued. That's why he decided कि I should help him. तो ऐसी चीजें आएंगी जो दो से ज्यादा भी सही होंगी बट यू हैव टू फाइंड व्हिच इज द मोर करेक्ट आंसर एंड मोर करेक्ट आंसर कौन देगा द चाइल्ड हु हैज रेड द चैप्टर थॉरोली फाइंड नो डिस्टरबेंस फ्रॉम एनी साइड यस नाउ प्रिंसी व्हाट वाज योर क्वेश्चन बेटा रिगार्डिंग दैट व्हाई ही Why? Why he was not surprised, है ना? The question was that because he had unwavering faith in God. उसको पता ही था मैंने दिखाया भी आपको that his faith was unshaken. उसका blind faith था God पे. इसलिए वो कोई reaction ही नहीं दिया उसने. Clear? आपको कोई confusion हो गया इस question पे? We'll discuss it later on. ठीक है? If you have doubt, uh, break में बात करते हैं इसके बारे में. Let me move further. because we are preparing for exam that's why aur aage se i will try uh, i will not be lingering on the chapter in for two days kyunki isse to aapka syllabus nahi ho payega revise theek hai ek chapter ek hi din mein karenge short mein and then uh, saath mein we will be doing mcqs also means one lecture one chapter in that way then we will be revising writing skills also uh which crop was Growing on Lenko's field, you can give the answer. Corn. Fine. Everybody is raising hand today, online or offline. That is good. Now, this is the question. If anybody has listened to, he'll be able to answer. Where did Lenko expect the downpour to come from? I repeat my question. These boys are not paying attention. Teacher is putting in effort. Students are not ready. Very good. Where did Lenko expect the downpour to come from? Karthik, stand me and tell me the meaning of downpour. Nobody will speak. What is downpour? Downpour. See, it's about rain only. So you do not pay attention. Okay, the question is from where? Which side he was expecting the rain to come? North option A, option B, north east, option C, north west, option D, south east. North east, fine. So you have to check these facts and give answers accordingly. Last question. You can see on the screen, beta. I am not going to change this one. Where was Lenko's house situated? Bottom of the hill, top of a hill, top of a plateau in a city. Fine. Okay, beta. Have a nice day. Tomorrow we'll do another chapter.